Welcome to the haunting of your life. <laughs> it's not Halloween. Probably when we upload this. But anyways, imagine it's the week of Halloween. Um, it's it's Hallow Halloween's month. Yeah. It's Halloween. A little bit bigger than Halloween, but you know, like still, still in the same category. You know what I mean? Hop in the comments if you're ready to Hallow go green. Hop in the comments if you prefer Halloween, Halloween, or Halloween. <laughs> Ooh. Yo, got the Halloween. <laughs> this is so bad. <laughs> Don't stop, editor. Let let it happen. Let let this horrible thing that I've created happen. In fact, make an animation of it. Oh my god. Just take JPGs and just just take JPGs and make an AMAJ bait. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I don't know why. <laughs> Some JAVs. Some dot JPGs. <laughs> This is this has gotten so weird <laughs> that anyone who gets these references, what is wrong with you? These are references. <laughs> Some of them oh. are. Some of them. Oh. All right. So we haven't played in <laughs> what is it? Three weeks. Um. So, uh -huh. well, welcome back to us. Actually, kind yes. of. Uh, you were talking. You know, we have. This is our first time recording during the, the spooky month as well as uploading during the spooky month. And so we're very excited for that because not only do we have to anticipate what the mood feels like, we are feeling the spooky mood right now. Um, yeah, tis the spook season. And now I dodge stuff. I always think to myself that I'll, I'll grow out of like vibes and moods. I'll be like, you know, I, I, I'll probably be too old to enjoy Halloween or Christmas this year and then you know it, it just creeps up on you like the, the feeling of the season is something that you can you can be a Scrooge about and pretend that you're not feeling it just happens man it just it, you and it, it's so good you, you, you know what so there good. there is something psychological to the concept of fall like ow um Shit. Yeah, we were talking about YouTubers are like all into the fall season, getting us into the mood and stuff like that. Gary, you had a few, you know, like, what were you talking about? Like, uh, I, you said you'd hold it till the episode, so I'm. This isn't. Just... I mean, this isn't necessarily spooky. Yeah. But it it it, it did just freshly happen. Uh, so, Papa Moist, Charlie Moist Critical. Um, so he was in a, he was ca called a jury duty recently um for the uh so G you geriatric am I, I was, uh, you, I, this is, uh, so you know the guy that like <laughs> you're trying so hard to play he <laughs> explain it's the guy that like got the donkey kong world high score like in the 90s or whatever and now he just does ca he just does cameos oh but he was also like caught as a fraud for yeah. Pac-Man? Is it the same guy who did the Pac-Man high know. score he that like, was a fraud? I, I don't know what the deal was, but he's like, there's... Well, it was, might he, be different from the Donkey Kong no, guy. It, they're, they're, the guy it, who did Pac-Man became a fraud. Oh. Uh, yeah. Well, so... So? Let's just cut all that out, honestly. I, this is... <gasps> no, I actually want to know what the deal is. So what happened to the Donkey Kong guy? Like, actually... Um, I don't think we said anything wrong. I'll, I'll be so, honest. I, I'll, I'll cut through and I'll keep it clean. I don't know. He was a sex pest or something, and there's a big court case. Really? And... Oh, that's too bad. I, it's so strange how like the you know when that happens is it happens when people start having fans that yeah, it's like... are hardcore fans and will do anything to stay fans. Yeah, because like... it's like that's the consequence. It, and, it, and like someone guy, ruins like, it. This guy basically that's he's just bad. been living off of like. Doing cameos like, Charlie, hey, though. I'm the guy that got the high score. Hey, congratulations, champ. 
your buddy paid me money to, to make this video for you kind of stuff. Yeah, yeah. Charlie, though, always gold all the time. Yeah, like, like I, he just... Charlie calls them out. He is, Charlie's... He is the personification of the public zeitgeist. To be straight. Oh, totally. Um, but yeah. So he was called to a court case, and uh, there were people on, like... So it wasn't... It wasn't the biggest deal ever, but, like, he was like, yeah, people... It's public, been, sure. Like, he was joking. People were like, people have been bugging me about giving this guy an apology, and so here's my apology, and then he, like, farts oh, into yeah, the... yeah, yeah, And they, they brought it up in court, because they're just doing what it... <laughs> That's, that's, really? They, yeah, they're like, this is... Really? Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Why would they do... Like, this is your video, correct, sir? And he's like, yeah, basically. I mean, I mean, uh, <laughs> more or less, it was like... Yeah. They, they were like, fr from the video, his video that I saw... He's got uh, such a good voice. Charlie, if you're out there and listening even for a second, you have a great voice. And remember, we're rooting for you. Always. Um, yeah, I have I, I, not... I. The only person who has only tried to give back with their fame, be nice with their fame, not take advantage of people with their fame, like, sure, chasing his dreams. Like, he probably goes to cons and stuff that he wants to go to and buys games that he wants to play. I don't think he and does he anything like more than buys being... and sells Pokemon cards, even yeah. though he's like in a city getting attacked by, a, or not a city, sorry, in a, in a state but getting attacked by a hurricane. He, oh man, really? Is yeah, there's a is? hurricane in Florida he, right I now. I didn't know he was from that area. I know yeah. Milton. Yeah, it's tragic. It sucks. I, I, I don't know exactly which part of Florida he's in, of course, but yeah, there's some crazy stuff going on. This year's been pretty tame, but the hurricane sucks. But back to like silliness and fun. Like this vibe of the season has been good. It I, has. I, there, there's, it's true. There, there's been like tragedy, and there's been brotherhood you know like the, the people really care when it comes to i feel like you, you hit october and then you go all the way till like christmas time and people are like really trying to work together it's true it's true yeah. oh actually speaking of like you know people that you might have liked who let you down no you're uh in, in, <laughs> our, in our uh in our super mario rpg i think series that we started a yeah. while ago really worth watching if you haven't seen it um i was talking about chugger conroy being one of the people that like influenced me to start doing all this stuff i guess i, I guess he uh did some uh feet stuff what does that sorry mean? hold on <laughs> what you what does that even mean uh, though so like like he, with his feet or other no, people's like feet? He unfortunately kept bugging someone and online and kept buying shoes and demanding pictures or allegedly something like that. Oh, and like that, that he, sucks. Uh, it, it sounds like what you're saying is he's a good person, but he became obsessive about some sort of like fantasy. Possibly. I, I don't know the whole story, obviously. But, right. I you don't know. know. It's like, his life. It's like, it's unfortunate. I think uh, uh, I think that um, these things happen, you know, and, and I don't think that like I agree with it, and I don't think that it would happen to me. But I also think that you know it's separating the art from the artist. You know, like I, I still think that what we do as let's players is can be equated to like the things he's done on the let's play side of his life, but not the like what you're talking about now. I think that's the that's the goal of when you do something. Like, if you want to be an actor or an actress, you know how many actors or actresses end up being, like, terrible people outside of their role? So many. But, like, at the same time, you still should learn to be a good actor. And if they're a good actor, you probably want to be, like, their acting skill, right? You know, like, if they're good yeah, players, like, if they're good people when they're like on, for instance, on the screen. You know, one of my one of my biggest influences ever since I was a kid was Jim Carrey. And I even like even I still think that Jim Carrey as like a performer and everything is very unmatched. Yeah, in a absolutely. Lot of ways. Like even when I like had my 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 own personal crisis during COVID and all that um everyone yeah, everyone, yeah. it's like, like feel free to drop yours in the chat like yeah yeah but like i i heard about i learned about his philosophy on the perception of the self and like 
you really was it to make funny faces? I mean, <laughs> I mean, that's... like he's so good at that. That's true. Anyways, um, but it's like, you know, it... this this character that everyone recognizes as Jim Carrey. And this was Kim Jerry. Kim Jerry. Yep. <laughs> Kim. Yeah. Um, Kim Jong Jerry. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's not. That's that's his Korean form. Dude, <laughs> that's messed up. Just kidding. <laughs> oh, it, I just spat on my is. mic. I, it, sorry, his, his his Korean dictator form in North Korea specifically. Yeah, it's it's another character that he plays. Or, uh, yeah. but you know, like, <laughs> it's that is probably too much. <laughs> this, Go ahead. The the wacky character that he used to be like in all those ninety movies. Yeah, was like based on when he was studying that um it's so what was it what does studying the, mean study. the, starting out what i am thinking way too hard right now oh okay <laughs> can you focus on the boss i anyways jim carrey you, you know what i'll say it while it's paused you know what just to get my thought out yeah um and then i need to be this boss you can do it Everyone in the chat, cheer. Come on, editor. Yeah. <laughs> I don't remember what I was talking about. Oh, it doesn't matter. Uh, we were talking about how there's, like, just too many angles to things. And the it, it, the way it is is, okay, it's like, have you ever seen, um, oh, how does it go? There's, like, this. this All right. Like, you know what? That's not what we were talking about. It was Jim Carrey, okay? Damn it. And Man on the Moon. <laughs> we're back on Jim Carrey. Man on the Moon was the the movie where he played about a character that was a, a comedian who was a human that he oh yeah acted like and then adapted a lot of that and then like shed it from himself when he reawakened and his third thigh opened. Interesting. That sounds like a Jim Carrey thing to do. He he's definitely the thing is he's changed in the public. And himself a lot, absolutely throughout his like like time in life. Yeah, it, he he was even. I don't, I'm pretty sure he isn't still, but he was briefly anti-vax. Every person has lots of sides, and you, the parts of the people that are good. Well, think of it like this: it, there are good pe things and bad things about every person, and you should abhor the bad things. We want to have like you know you, you don't really want bad people in your life, but the good things. All right, sorry, the phrase goes, bad people can do good things, and good people can do bad things. So, like, that's that's what it is. You know, like, sometimes bad things happen because uh, sometimes good people do bad things and bad people do good things. That's true. Like, like SpaceX. 